Hello friends, welcome, hearty welcome to you. As part of applications of integration, areas of bounded regions, let's look at this example. We have to find the area of the region x square plus y square less than or equals to 4, x plus y greater than or equal to 2. Now to solve the problem, what we will do first, we will try to understand what is x square plus y square equals to 4. It is a circle we know with center at 0 comma 0 and radius equals to 2. Now what is x plus y equals to 2 is a line. It is a straight line which is passing through the points 2 comma 0, 0 comma 2 and what we have to find out is the area of the region which is less than or equals to 4 with respect to the circle. That means all the area whichever is inside the circle, all those points will satisfy this condition that x square plus y square is less than or equals to 4. Similarly, x plus y greater than or equal to 2 is given by all the points which are on the which are on the right side of the straight line. That means any point which will satisfy x plus y greater than or equal to 2 will be either on this line or out or to the right side of the line. That means away from the origin. Now, what we need to find out? We need to find out the area of the region between these two. That means we have to find out the area of this particular area which is which is common between these two conditions. 1 x square plus y square is less than or equals to 4. That means all the po points which are inside the circle, the total area of the circle and uh, x plus y greater than or equals to 2. That means all the points which are to the right side of x plus y equals to 2. Now you see that both of these conditions are satisfied by only this particular area. So what we need to do now is we need to take a vertical strip and find out the area of the region between we have to find out the area of the region between these two curves that's nothing but this particular area. Now for that we will write down first we will write down area is equals to a to b y dx that's equals to x values x value is changing from here we know x is 0 here we know x equals to 2 so can I write down 0 to 2 and when we want to find out the y coordinate we want to find out the height of the vertical strip or y coordinate first we have to take y coordinate from the circle We'll write down that we know x square plus y square is 4. That means y square equals to 4 minus x square. That means y equals to square root of 4 minus x square. So square root of 4 minus x square minus then the y coordinate of the line is given by y equals to 2 minus x because x plus y equals to 2. So can I go ahead and write down minus 2 minus x. This whole thing we have to integrate and put the boundaries values from 0 to 2. So let's recap this what we have done so that we can go to the next step. We have been asked about we have to find out the area of the region where x square plus y square is less than or equals to 4. That means it's the area of the circle x plus y greater than or equal to 2. That is the all the point all the all the region all the points which satisfy this condition are to the right side of the straight line are on the straight line. Now these two conditions whatever we want the common area for both of them the area of the region between them is this particular area and to find out that area what we have done we have we are using vertical strip method so we know x coordinate x is changing from 0 to 2 and we need to find out the 
height of the vertical strip that is y coordinate of the circle minus y coordinate of the straight line that is square root of 4 minus x square minus 2 minus x dx now we have to simply substitute we have to do integration and substitute the values 2 to 0 and find out the area so let's go ahead and do the next step so let's go ahead to the next step and integrate this we have this of the form of root of a square minus x square so what's the integration for that x by 2 root of a square minus x square that is 4 minus x square plus a square by 2 here a is 2 because this is square root of 2 square minus x square so a is 2 a square by 2 is 4 by 2 sin inverse x by a that is x by 2 now this whole thing we have to put values boundaries 2 to 0 minus of again 2 minus x integration 2 integration is 2x minus x integration is x square by 2 we have to put 2 to 0 yes so let's go ahead and substitute the values now put x equals to 2 substituting we'll get 2 by 2 into 4 minus 4 that is 0 plus 4 by 2 2 into sin inverse 2 by 2 that is sin inverse of 1 so this value we have minus when we when, when we substitute 0 we get everything as 0 so we will not touch that part or maybe we can make them as flower bracket ok right minus of again let's go here we have first x equals to 2 so 2 into 2 minus of 2 square by 2 that is 4 by 2 we don't have anything other than that we have subtract with 0 so this will be 2 into sin inverse 1 is pi by 2 minus 4 minus 2 is 2 so the answer is pi minus 2 square units now how can we check whether this is correct or not we have an option here what we will do for that what we want is this area that is nothing but quadrant minus right angle triangle so can I go ahead with formula quadrant 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 minus right angle triangle area quadrant is 1 by 4 into pi into r square we know radius is 2 so 4 minus area of the triangle half into base is 2 into height that is also 2 we simplify we get pi minus 2 which is the same what we got earlier through integration so our solution that pi minus 2 square units is correct now let's recap this we have to find the area of the region in x and y x square plus y square is less than or equals to 4 and x plus y greater than or equals to 2 x square plus y square equal to 4 is a circle x square plus y square less than or equals to 4 means all the points which are inside or on the circle represent this particular area x square plus y square less than or equals to 4 now x plus y equals to 2 is given by this particular line x plus y greater than or equals to 2 is given by all the points which are to the right side or which are away from the origin or on the right side of the straight line now we want these two conditions to be satisfied then we have to that is possible only with respect to this particular area now we need to find out this area which is enclosed which is actually the straight line cutting the circle and the area we are finding out or basically can I say this is something like a segment this segment area we want to find out if this is the card now how to find out that by integration for that we are using area how to find out it's given we, we can use vertical strip or horizontal strip when I take vertical strip area will be boundaries a to b a to b y dx 
Now a is starting from x equals to 0 and we are going to x equals to 2 and y coordinate strip height is given by y coordinate of the circle minus y coordinate of the straight line that is square root of 4 minus x square minus 2 minus x. Once we are that we can go back and do the integration and substitute 2 comma 0 and we can get our solution which is pi minus 2 square units. We can check that also because area of segment is area of sector minus area of triangle. Area of sector it is a quadrant 90 degrees. So, pi minus area of triangle right angle triangle isosceles right angle triangle half into 2 into 2. So, the answer is pi minus 2 square units.